wanted a bronze tomato. My life for a bronze tomato. <laughs> hey everyone, welcome back to Kimchika's Cafe. It's time to sit back, relax, and enjoy Coral Island. Uh, we have made some really good progress the last few days, and I'm super excited that tomatoes are actually starting to show show their form, to show themselves. Um, looks like we're still waiting in on all of these. Uh, you have to right click on the, what is it? the machines for the, the honey just to see what the progress is. Um, but it looks like we have an upgrade. Maybe that's available. Uh, hello, Kimchika. I say a house is not a home until you can cook in it. Joko and I can upgrade your house and add a nice kitchen. Visit us when you're ready for an upgrade. Hell yeah. I, the heart is ready, but the wallet is not, I think. Um, right now we've, finally gotten a lot of progress and I think I've finally gotten to the point where we can make a lot of these upgrades that we want to happen. Uh, oh geez, I need, I need to grab some hay. I don't know if I have any, nope. So let's grab some hay for the chickies. Uh, what's nice is that we should again be on track to get the tomato by the end of, oh right, I reorganized everything. I put hay in a closer spot so that I wouldn't have to be, you know, travel everywhere to get it. And it looks like I forgot my past, uh, what is it, efficiencies. There we go. We're just going to fill it up. No harm. It's not like I'll lose the hay. It'll get eaten eventually. All right. So because... We have, oh, and I think someone mentioned if we go into, we can like select which uh, quests are tracked, which is really cool. Um, I feel like, I mean, I guess technically since I'm doing the produce one, I've been keeping it up there. I've been able to keep track of most of them in my mind um, relatively well. Trying to think what I should focus on today. <laughs> um, we were waiting for the pick starter. Our local produce, we're, sh we're continuing to ship. I think maybe going to the caverns and continuing to harvest for more silver is really wise. We've got a, what you call it, a barn in the works. And so what's nice is we're kind of in like a really sweet spot of things are Things are now chugging along. Things are looking good. It may be worthwhile for me uh, to start focusing a little more on talking with folks that I haven't gotten to talk to yet. Uh, I've really only passed people by and and talked to them if they've crossed my path. And, and I think we can start getting to know folks a little bit more in the village. What's Important to keep in mind, though, is that because this is early access, I don't believe romancing is currently available. I think we can only foster friendships. Oh, there was a fishy that jumped. Oh, that was so cute. Uh, so if anyone's wondering also why I haven't really been focusing on talking, uh, it's because I know that the full relationship system is not developed yet. I also know that for different characters, uh, they're more, some are more far along than others with their dialogue. Oh my goodness, this piano music is beautiful. Once again, I'm thinking it's time for me to, to start practicing piano and learn some of these songs. Right. We have cows coming in with the barn, or we will. Uh, my hope is to also gather enough money so that I can get a cow and take good care of it while while we start up the next era of our ranch. Um, I can't see what bug is, is behind this exclamation point, so I'm not going to worry about it too much right now. Hey, what's up, Ben? I hear people complain about the heat, but nah, mate, just enjoy the heat. Absorb all the good sun. <laughs> it's funny you're mentioning that on maybe one of the rainiest days we've had. 
I guess we've had a good amount of rain. Uh, it's been nice to see things get a little bit more water on them. No drought on this island, that's for sure. I need to wash the hot spring sign by the observatory. It's been a while since I did that. Last summer, I think. Oh, The hot springs. I can't wait to be able to use the hot springs. Oh, excuse me. Um, that's one other element uh, that has me very excited for when we finally get to an update or just 1.0 in general for the full launch, being able to finally use all the facilities on the island. We haven't heard too much about, oh, wait, did I unlock this? I guess I did. Well, that's cool. It's good to know that we have now fast travel right next to the blacksmith. Oh, do I need to pick up something? I might have, I might have dropped off a tool. Let's see. Aha, we did. Bronze watering can, nice. Uh, do I have any geodes? Yes, I have a coffer. Silver sandal, that's neat. All right, we can drop that off in the museum. Gotta say hi to Raphael. Upgrading a tool, Kimchika? Upgrading my affection for you. <laughs> Your affection for me through talking. I want to know what else we can do to continue to upgrade our town rank. I suspect doing things like probably upgrading our seeds, getting more of that essence to the science lab will be a thing. Once we do the coral reef, that's certainly going to help upgrade the town. Uh, but I don't know what else we could potentially do to, to make sure things are looking good. All right, today is... Oh gosh. I miss the Disco and Color Festival. Okay, so it's the 22nd. Oh, I see. That's so, I didn't know what to look for. So we missed, aw, oh, we missed a lot of birthdays, but, but we do have two more birthdays coming up, so we should definitely keep those in mind. And at the end of the month, we have Yuri's birthday, as well as the beach cleanup, and speak of the devil, hey Yuri. I took a walk by the lake the other day and saw so many colorful flowers. What a season, I agree. It's a very good season. Now I don't know if there's any seeds we haven't purchased that I would want to. I think for the most part, we've, we've completed the Harvest Goddess summer pack basically so i think we're okay for now i guess since i'm here i might as well buy a couple lumps of sugar can i sell you Ooh, that's cool i didn't realize i could sell you things directly that's fun i don't know if there's any specific benefit or not oh that's cool uh oh lily i haven't talked to lily in so long I try to eat one fruit a day every day. I like to be consistent. Oh my gosh, my favorite fruit right now. I've been really, I'm not an apple person, but I've been really craving and into apples. I don't know what that means, but it's been kind of neat. I, uh, there's this new apple that I tried called, it's like a lemon apple or a lemonade apple. <laughs> and I don't know what that means, like if they crossbred it with a lemon. It wasn't that tart, but it was very delicious. Oh, can I not talk to Aaliyah? Weird, okay. We haven't talked to them yet today. Oh, hey, what's up, Frank? Ah! Frank, come back, Frank! Come in, come in. I just wanted to say hi. Do you feel like it rains more in summer than other seasons? I hope not. I hope we get a lot of rain in the fall because <laughs> uh, I, I feel like I kind of messed up planting, honestly, in the summer. I, I very much underestimated the length of the crops. Like I read, I remember reading, you know, 12 days, 15 days. Ooh, a koi. But something about it didn't register in my brain and so it's interesting now, I'm like, oh my God, it's taking so long. Join me fishing, Kimchika. 
Well, see now I'd feel like a jerk for not. So let's let's do one one bout of fishing. Oh, we're hanging out with Zara. This is so cool. I wonder if we'll be able to get a new fish. We've been catching a lot of mackerel, uh, especially in this area. I feel like this is where the mackerel like to hang out. What was the crawdads? That's what was mostly in the sort of freshwater areas. All right, we gotta, we gotta impress. We gotta impress. Ha ha ha! And hark! Just another mackerel. This is, I feel like the mackerel is like the sea, was it the sea bass? Or was it a C plus? Um, <laughs> sorry. Um, it's, it's, the, it's the sea bass of um, Coral Island. Animal Crossing reference for those who, who are like, what the heck are you talking about? <laughs> All right, so we just have to donate our sandal. Looks too uncomfortable for daily wear. Yeah, definitely does. Probably something more fancy, maybe for a special celebration or performance or ritual. Because those that platform definitely looked scary to walk on. We've got stuff at the beach that we could potentially harvest. I imagine, especially on one of our, the rainier days, I wonder if there is a chance of more things cropping up on the beach shore. Uh, I don't know if there's... Ooh. Oh, I don't want to go this way. I wonder if there is a sort of different percentage that happens on rainy days, especially for the coast, but it feels like there should be. Just because on rainy days you get more waves that come up. Oh, that crab was not having it. Well, but it looks like maybe not. <laughs> it's quite empty over here. <gasps> silver kelp. We just got our first silver kelp. We can get them on the beach. I should come here every day. Oh my god. Tomatoes be damned. We don't need tomatoes. Oh, dang it. That was also a new bug. We don't need your tomatoes. Uh, silver kelp can be found on the beach. Okay, I need to remember that. That's so cool. All the missed opportunities. I could have had <laughs> tens of silver kelp by picking them one, on, one by one at the beach. Oh, hey, what's up? I still fish here and there, you know, especially now in salmon season. You have talked about salmon, I think, nearly every time we've chatted. So uh, as soon as I get a salmon that I can give, I need to give it to him. I like to take inspiration from the beach sometimes. The shells, the sea, so much material. Ooh, in your bakes? Or do you also do other arts? Arts and crafts projects? All right. It's not too late. We still got a lot of time, but today today is a social day. Hey, Suki. Didn't the weather forecast say it wasn't going to rain today? Oh, you don't like the rain. I'm a little busy now. Yeah, you're reading. I don't want to interrupt. Well, I mean, I did, but... Okay, I don't have the ability to go into anyone's rooms, which is really unfortunate. Oh, yep, not close enough to Valentina, not close enough to anyone. I wonder at what heart point we will. I imagine probably two. That's what I would, that's what I would let someone in my room. You have to be at two heart to be able to enter. Oh, have I caught that bug before? I'm gonna let, the, let it calm down quickly and then walk this away. hi yeah. Pines up Sphinx. Okay, I've definitely caught that before. I don't think there will be anything up here. But just needed to check and make sure. I don't think I can go in. Oh! What? 
I can. Not close enough to Waku. Not close enough to Wataru. But who, what was the thing, the note that I got? I need to go, I guess. I just need to get there before sundown and just chill and wait. Because I feel like every time I go to the lighthouse, it's not the right time. There's another section of beach here. And then I think we can probably head back and... Ooh, sandstone, that's good. Ooh, okay, so I was totally wrong. The beach did not seem to have any more fresh things to look at or grab. In fact, I think maybe I had less than what we normally find, but we've also been to the beach relatively frequently, so there must not be an increased percentage of item drops during rainy days. Well, there we go. All right, let's go back in home. Uh, we have stuff I could ship, so actually let me, <laughs> let me try and, and make some sort of money today and ship all these things. I'll save the Cosmo. I will definitely save that silver kelp. I haven't shipped any before, but can ship both of those. I, I don't want to give up the only silver kelp that I have. Please let the tomatoes... <sighs> Again, Tomato Watch 2022. Ooh, fertilizer. <gasps> and we can make sashimi. Oh my god. I love sashimi. And we finally have a full heart with Raphael and a full heart with Jim. Really likes talking with us about salmon. <laughs> So today will be the first day we also get to use our new watering can. I'm excited to see what the the radius and the range will be for, oh, it was already full, for crops. Oh, can we? There we go. I think it'll be just a row of three, but who knows? It might surprise me. Oh! <gasps> Tomato, let's go. We got a tomato. -da 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 -da. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, we got a water and then we are going down, you betcha, to the coral reefs. Oh, interesting. Okay, so it goes vertically from... Ah, shucks. Okay, this is... This is going to take me getting used to. I feel like I'm... <laughs> okay, so if I'm facing it, it will go straight away from me. Oh. Happy music though. I just I just need sprinklers, but it looks like we are going to be very close to getting them because we finally have the ability to get a little bit further. Yeah, the first thing I'm gonna do, make as many sprinklers as my little farmer hands can. Okay, this is, it's almost, it feels faster to just water all of the things manually. I don't know if that's just me or what. Let me also plant, because we can, these last little seeds. I don't know what will grow, but who knows? Who knows? Oh, hold on, I need to quickly remove my cat. I love Rosie, but sometimes she gets a little too stompy. <laughs> it's not very good for when I'm really trying to focus in, really get my pro pro farming skills out there, you know? So, chickies, you are welcome. <gasps> oh my gosh, today is gonna be such a big day. Not only do we have enough, well, we have enough uh, tomato, one, to go to the coral reef, we have a barn. And this means we can get a cow. Time to get a cow. All right, we're gonna get a cow first. I'm so excited. I have been really, really, <laughs> oh, cow. Step aside, I'm ordering a cow. So let's, I'm in no rush. I'm in no rush. We can get baby cow. It is so much cheaper, half the price. Uh, yeah, we're gonna get baby cow. Milk pail, okay, and we need the milk 
milk pail to harvest. So you're going to live in this barn, baby cow, and I'm going to call you... Mm, I'm going to call you Belle. Oh, okay, beautiful. Jack, thank you so much. So now we need to... Oh. Let me just let me just water your counter for you. Looks like this wood needs a nice little shine. Um, you know, upgrade from spit, spit and elbow grease. I'm giving you water. Uh, we also need a milk pail. Okay, I hope we don't need to get individual milk pail per cow. That seems like it would be nonsensical, but. I should also, I, I should be a kind neighbor. Let me actually talk to Jack, see how he's doing from a personal standpoint. Make sure to let your animals out of the barn once in a while, okay? I mean, every day it's not raining, Jack. I, I, I get it. They love, they love the sunshine. So Bella should now be in the barn. I am going to let her out. Wah! I'm gonna let her out. But first, I must. Oh, I will pet. So cute. Okay. Calling all cows. So I didn't pet the chicky. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> Look at her galloping. Oh, this is, this is absurdly cute. That's really funny. <laughs> I know they're going to polish that animation, but oh my god. The slow-mo Baywatch cow. Um, let's ship all of these. I don't have a kitchen. I probably should hang on to some of these, but I imagine once I unlock the greenhouse, like, we'll, we'll get the recipes later. Do not sell... <laughs> Me talking to myself, do not sell the tomato. Sweet. All right, we can we can do it. Let's dive. The day is young, we'll have a lot of time. I have, I have a decent amount of space in my inventory. Uh, Theo, hey, my love. The summer breeze feels different on my face. A little saltier than spring, if you wanna know. Nope, I, I will refrain. I will refrain from the innuendo that I was thinking, but that's, you can just use your imagination. <laughs> All right. All right, turtle friend. Ooh, let's collect these, first of all. And let's get that, was it the sickle that I used? Yeah. Let's get these pieces of trash out of here. Figure we're right next to it. We might as well. And would you like a tomato? No, do not consume. Talk. Can I just? How do I? How do I give a turtle a tomato? I'm right clicking. It's not letting me talk to it. I just. Oh. No. They wanted a bronze tomato. My life for a bronze tomato. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> That's so sad. Well, see you later. I won't say a uh, tur turtle gator. Uh, we have not achieved the thing I thought we achieved. I'm gonna go drown my sorrows at the fish and sips. <laughs> so sad. No. This tomato I will save. But I still want to talk to you, Eleanor. Living at the beach can get intense during this time of year. Even with our windows open, sometimes we still can't beat the heat at night. I'm just so mad up with the tomatoes. I thought I fertilized all of them. Easily the best thing about summer is the abundance of jackfruit. I can make as many minced jackfruit pies as I want. I've never had jackfruit or minced jackfruit. What a lovely day. 
I might bake moon cakes later to enjoy with some evening tea. I have had moon cakes, and they are very delicious. Hmm. Well, after the disappointment of the century, what's some what's what's a farmer to do? Drown my sorrows. I really sh I should just. I should at some point, when I have more money to spare, see if you can get tipsy at the tavern. My goodness, I am just so sad. Machine is full, none of them are quite ready. Oh my goodness, when will the disappointments end? <laughs> oh, that's fine, I'm, I'm fine, we're okay. drop those off. One thing I would like to check really quickly is the ocean pack from the goddess. I haven't seen, I know rock salt is on there, which I have not seen yet on this playthrough. Uh, it's interesting because I have another that I, I'm doing via stream and rock salt I found like the first time I went down into the coral, which was interesting. Or sea salt, not rock salt. Calico scallop. Eastern oyster, blue mussels. Okay, I feel like I did see a sea urchin, but perhaps it was not purple. I'm writing this down really quickly. Okay. Hmm. I really hope that as I move into getting more of the coral reef unearthed, that I can just, uh, I can just quickly get to unlocking the greenhouse. I do have two pieces of sugar, so I have a little bit of energy. Oh, hey, Kira. I love Kira. I can't really teach you combat. You just need to go out there and fight. Tough love. All right. <laughs> we have been moving our way slowly down the water shaft. The enemies pretty much the same as the earth shaft. Ooh, we've already got some gemstones. Where's my pickaxe? There we go. Ooh, lep lepidolite? Lepidolite. All right, nothing there. I just, oh, here we go. Silver can be a little bit harder to see only because the, <laughs> the color of the ore itself is very similar to the rock. I wish they'd make it just a little bit more differentiated, whether it's making it shinier, a little bit lighter. Um, that's just because my eyes are bad. All right, we'll just knock these ones out. And, ow. And see if we can get just a little bit, little bit of extra progression in, in this area going. <laughs> <laughs> running up to this bridge I was like can I should I dare I walk on this I hope this is something that isn't so unfinished that I would fall through okay nothing fell out of there it's it was really neat to see the different sort of um, what is it the pathing that kind of feels a little bit different in the water shaft versus the earth uh, Earth seem to have more of those spirals that kind of go to the center and water does seem a bit more overall winding. I don't know if that's just the luck of the draw and kind of what I've been seeing just because that's just what happened to show up, but it does feel nice to be like, oh yeah, Earth and water. Not only are the rocks different colors, the rooms themselves feel different. I'm hoping, again, as we move out of early access into getting various updates, moving into 1.0 next year, there is more polish both in the enemy encounters as well as, obviously you can see, there's there's still polish and work needed on these rooms themselves. Oof, I have been, I've been getting through a lot of the rocks in this room though. I didn't make any ropes and I wish I did. I was honestly really excited to for Tomato Watch to be done and to be doing coral reef things, so <laughs> I was not prepared to go cavern. Oh, <gasps> pretty. Ooh, I was not prepared to go cavern diving today. Let's eat one of the sugars, maybe two. 
still have a couple of hours left, so I, I don't want to waste all of my uh, sugar on... Ooh, okay, I see a little truffle over there, mushroom. I don't want to waste all the sugar if, if we're just going to go to bed soon, but I also want to get at least one more level just so we have level 20 down. Oops, harvest. Not seeing anything. No silver here, no gems. We've been pretty unlucky in finding uh, materials for crafting, materials for just selling valuable gems. So today is just a get down, get get down, get deeper and down, get down, get deeper and down. Saturday night. That is a Spice Girls reference. I wouldn't say deep cut, but a deeper than you might think. Ooh, explosive. All right, let's let's get these boxes. Got some seeds. That's good. Some wood. Can I break this pot? Oh, I can. <laughs> just for the heck of it, just to see what's down there, since it's quite easy. We've got spideys. Okay, nothing, nothing's popping up immediately, and it's getting late, so we're gonna head back. I wonder if we'll be ever, we'll ever see things go on these shelves. I think that would be kind of an interesting detail, especially because we have other characters that are clearly exploring and using these caverns. I think that'd be kind of fun if that was something that could be added in. All right, it looks like animals are all back in. I still, I still am trying to envision how I'd like to organize my stuff, uh, my farm. Duck mussel, oh, that's new. Well, it's the, the, what's her face didn't want it, the goddess, so I'm just gonna ship it. Okay, let's, let's plant the rest of these wild seeds because we can. And we'll do that because it's already watered. Awesome. Well, it's a pretty, pretty decent day in terms of, <laughs> we got some stuff done. Was it disappointing? Absolutely. <laughs> but that's okay. What's life without, you know, the lows? So we can appreciate the highs. Isn't that the saying? Oh, bless. Thank you so much for the rain. Looks like we do have some. Please be bronze. Please be bronze. Is that bronze? It looks like it's not quite the same shade of, of orangey red. Gold. God, the only time I'd ever be mad about a gold tomato. <laughs> Why can we not? Why? The first time in my life I've ever been sad about overachieving. <laughs> Why? <sighs> Inventory full. You know, maybe we're just never going to be meant to... <laughs> <laughs> Never meant. Never meant for the coral reef. <sighs> well, I might as well ship it, I guess, because we, we just... The turtle doesn't want gold. The turtle wants bronze. I mean, I could take it out and try and see if it's possible, like, a bronze or higher situation is happening. I'll do that. I, I, I would be so sad if that ended up being the case. Oh shoot, okay here. So I'll take it back. Oh, I need to drop off my blueberries. And we'll see, we will see. I, I doubt, I have my doubts. I don't think we'll be able to move forward with a gold tomato despite me giving the turtle better than what it wants. Although I do think that if I were designing it, I would say bronze or up would be good. <laughs> like why, why, why can't you just let me do that? Who knows, maybe they did, maybe they did think of that. Okay, chickies, I need you to move.
and Bella. Hello, my sweet, sweet, beautiful cow. Oh, where's the hay? There we go. I will just drop this here, Bella. You will eat it as, as needed. Okie dokie, so we're gonna put the hay back. We are going to drop off some of the eggs, AKA both of the eggs. And I'm going to put the silver kelp in my ocean finds, as long, along with, um, oh, it was the black sea urchin, okay. We do have essence. Maybe I'll head on to the lab and we can get some of that done at least. <sighs> so sad. Okay, this is just chest for now. I'm trying to be a bit better about organizing things and keeping them that way. I go through phases though. <laughs> it's like, there will be days where I just dump everything into one random box and we'll just we'll figure it out later. Let's ship this honey. Oh, that rain sound is so good. We'll, we'll see what the turtle has to say. Judge and jury. Well, at the very least, we get some bronze kelp after coming here, so at least we got that. <laughs> and turtle, oh turtle, what say you? <gasps> you do take better tomatoes! Oh my god! Thank you, developers, for making it bronze and up. Oh my gosh. Oh. Goodbye, turtle friend. I will see you later. Oh, I was I was not ready, clearly, because look at me. I didn't even empty out my inventory. Okay, well, we'll do the best we can with the space we have, and... <sighs> Oh, at least we, at least we're progress. We finally did it, y'all. I'm so excited. I cannot believe that it's taken us almost to the end of summer to be able to do this. I feel very silly. Like, I, I feel like I should have been able to catch, like, like, grow cucumbers. But I was looking back and I don't think I... I really don't think I saw cucumbers in the shipping list, so that must be either a they've locked it so you can't do it, you can't do cucumbers the first season, or maybe I missed a way to unlock cucumbers just as a whole. Okay, inventory full. Again, inventory full. Oh, we're getting so close. Oh yeah, here we go. We found the next, oh gosh, what was it called again? It's been so long, solar, solar thing. We found the next one. Now I, what do I toss? I really want to harvest this and I don't want to get, not get that, but I think we're just gonna have to leave it. And I, I believe if we go and come back in the same day, it should be okay. So we're just going to have to go drop a bunch of stuff off and come back. But I wanted to at least unlock this one uh, shrine solar receiver and, and at least drop anchor here behind the turtle before, <laughs> before I moved on. This area looks like it's totally blocked off, but it looks like up north that's where we'll be able to progress. You can see the trash and some of the items over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okie dokie. So let's move the anchor, drop it over here, and we will be back. I'm so excited. Maybe we'll even go and buy some sugar. And maybe even open the coffers. I would love to just really bust ass <laughs> to get is that the phrase to bust your butts bust bust your ass to get things done <laughs> that feels wrong to say maybe i should not <laughs> it seems like it's not right okie dokie so this is one of those cases i'm just gonna drop everything in there except for those and we're gonna arrange things later 
Actually, since we're going into town, we might as well bring the essence, see if we can pay for an upgrade, see if that'll improve the town rank. Doopy doo boo Hey, another koi. I'm back! So we've got a couple of cool coffers to process. Ancient compass, which I think I might have found already, and mask grade mask does look familiar too. I will say hello to... Nope, do not give that gift. I'm not exaggerating. When I say the beach cleanup festival is my favorite. Aw, I love seeing the islanders come together and achieve something. I'm very excited for that. Again, I don't know if we'll be able to actually do the festival, but I love that the festival's there. Getting the right weapon can really help with slaying certain monsters. That's neat. Again, for those of you who are watching, I have been trying to stay away from seeing too much of what updates they have planned, mostly because I like the element of surprise. Uh, for those of you who know, you may, maybe you know that there's already monsters and stuff coming up. I would imagine, you know, because we only have two enemy varieties, probably more variety is coming up, but... Oh, I do not have the money for a second level seed upgrade, but I do have, let's see, plant, fruit tree. Oh, so fruit tree is different than plant itself. I'll do plant. I'll purchase that. That's a hefty, hefty sum. And I know we also really wanted to get our house upgraded to... It'll all pan out. It'll all work in the end. It'll all come out in the wash. <laughs> in the summer rain. That's where it'll all come out of. Alright, so we've got enough time. Let's go down. I think we probably could... I would say get at least one more solar panel opened. Oh <gasps> god, I love this game and the fact that we can just pick up where we left off, pick up the items that we couldn't originally, just so good. So what's really neat, and it's still a work in progress, it's not totally done, but look at the Mermaid Kingdom that I think we're stumbling into at this point in time. A steamer clam, yum yum. Oh, now I really want some seafood. There's this place nearby my house that does like crab and the crab boil bags, basically. Oh, it's, it's the best. I wonder if this is a place I could go into or interact with currently? No. Oh my gosh. Look at the little seahorse statues at the front. I'm so excited. I know from just knowing and following the game on Twitter and the Kickstarter that there are mermaids that we'll be able to discover as we delve deeper, but so far we haven't, we haven't seen anything come up yet. No mermaids have been met. But clearly, they're somewhere around here. Just because we have the explicit sort of goal right here that we're working on, I decided to put it up on the quest, uh, quest log. Again, I am so sorry I'm blinking on who mentioned in the comments, but I appreciate you putting that tip in there. So we've, we're just over halfway. I would love to get to 12 today. That's my goal. And it looks like we'll be able to, because I see the I see the altar there. Ooh, new mushroom. Oh wait, no, I think I've I've seen this before. Sea mushroom, yeah. All right, seahorse is so cute. It doesn't even care that I'm hanging out. It knows what I'm up to. It it knows that I'm trying to help it out. Not it specifically, just the ocean. I'm trying to help the ocean out. Ooh. Once again, I'm at low stamina, and finally I was able to activate this. Now, I don't think... <laughs> what stinks is I might not be able to actually do it because uh, it might be blocked. We shall see. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, oh dang it. 
There we go, please. Oh my god. You're killing me. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Whatever it takes, we will get the goal done. Woof, we at least did that. We won't get to see the beautiful colors re-emerging, unfortunately. But at least we can drop anchor here and know that when we come back, the ocean will be restoring and refreshing itself once again. <laughs> Let's let's head on out. Bye. We we deserve some rest after what an eventful day this turned out to be. I'm so happy and so excited. It's nice. It's nice that we are at this point where we're making the progress that we are. Uh, the the pacing of this game has felt really good for me. Where just as soon as I was like, oh, we're hitting a bit of a lull. If I can't figure it out. You know, I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, turns out, nope, no need to worry. It's all working according to plan. All right, so I think I should be able to drop in. Cosmo honey. There we go. And let's do hibiscus honey. Uh, the koi. I'll have to double check on the ancient compass and and uh, what was it? Masquerade mask. I'm relatively sure, relatively sure that we did already submit them, but who knows? Who know? Who's to say? Oh, so so good! And look at all that money, 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 money. So let's do one more day, one more dawn, one day more, uh, to just see, we won't finish the coral quest. I imagine doing eight of those, ah, perhaps if we started right now. Silver. See, we never got a bronze tomato. We've never been able to achieve that. But I think being able to go one more time down there, see how far we can get, that would be really, really cool. I'll go and buy a bunch of sugar as well because I think, I don't know. So I've, I've surprised myself before, so perhaps that will happen again. All right, let me, I just wanna, I, can, I, can I pet you? Thank you. I need to give a love and affection to my chickies. And to Bella. <laughs> Running in beautiful slow-mo as always. <laughs> oh, I love the cows in this game. Thank you. We've got two large eggs. I'm feeling like a successful farmer, successful rancher, successful diver. <laughs> I'm a bitch, I'm a mother. Uh... Hmm. We might be able to go to the blacksmith and get the final coffer opened up. That might be kind of nice. And let me check too. Perhaps we could upgrade one more tool. Uh, we don't have we don't have the bronze. We do not have the bronze. But we also don't have the silver. I need I need to make one more of of these doodads uh, that make the th bars. All right, let's check that actually. Crafting, crafting. How? Uh, what do you need? Stone and bronze ore. Ah, it will take up all my bronze, but I think ultimately that will be better. So let me grab some stone. Let's see, let's craft a furnace, beautiful. And we should also make some time. We do have, I think we are short a little bit of glass still, but that's only because I haven't crafted it. I would like to, oh, can I, can I, can I place you? There we go. I would like to get some mason jars going, just because it will make our vegetables 
be worth more. That's pretty much it. Oh, and we've had so many rainy days. I've completely forgotten. We also need to just water, water the, the plants. <laughs> oh, that actually, yeah, I would love for this to charge just a hair faster. And this could just be me being spoiled, but <laughs> I feel like it feels faster to water them manually. I'd be curious if I were to actually test that out and time it, if it would be equivalent or maybe, maybe this is faster, but I would like this to just move just a little bit, like a split second faster. Alrighty, bronze bar numero uno. I guess I didn't need to click that. Let's let's just leave it in our inventories. I want to go to the blacksmith. I want to get things done. So, oh puppy. It's Thursday. Okie dokie. We'll open up the coffer, go to the museum, and see if we can get a little bit further. Oh, I forgot. We also need to what you call it? I was gonna shop for something. Sam's for sugar. And this is perfect because I believe they are open on Wednesdays. Thursdays, they're closed on Wednesdays. All right, I want all the sugar my pockets can carry. Boo, 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 That's pretty good. And I could sell the Cosmo, but I think instead I'm going to give it to this person who I have forgotten their name because I haven't even talked to them very much. Emma, this is delish. Uh oh, knowing where this fruit is grown helps me feel more connected to the island. It also supports local farmers, right? Yeah, I still haven't gotten over the story um, that we learned about Emma and Sam, actually, because Emma used to work at the grocery store and Sam supported her. Oh, I forgot the birthdays. Uh, Sam supported her in her venture to create a like a taco stand. And I think that's really cool. It's A, it's just being a good person. It's being a good boss. Uh, it's helping your community and it's got that sort of, I don't know. It's something that you don't often see even talked about in games, which is really cool that it's in here. <sighs> Are you ready? I am not, I'm a dingbat. I totally forgot, museum. It's like, why is my inventory looking so full? It's because <laughs> it is. Do, do, do. I haven't noticed too many additional bugs, but I do think that I have to remember, we started off this month catching a lot of the summer bugs. So I, I think we're okay in terms of, oh, really all of these have been contributed. I think we're okay in terms of where we're at with summer bug catching. I think we've gotten most of them. If anything, we're better off from the summer standpoint than spring because I I definitely missed a lot of the spring buggies. Ooh. Nothing popped out there, huh? Wow, okay, that's a <laughs> really unfortunate. <laughs> Those four leaf clovers were all unlucky. There we go, finally, some seeds, thank you. Back, back into the ocean, here we go. Oh yes, I love coming down here and seeing everything just be grass and kelp rather than simply garbage. That's so, so nice. Now I know uh, it's probably, it is, it is a waste to simply just go back over an area where I know that I've already activated something so I don't need to take out all the trash but it just feels really good so I'm gonna continue to do that uh, I'm hoping there was a whole area to the left of this to the left of that mermaid house that we saw that I need to go to but I'm curious to see if it also maybe circles around so by us going towards the right we'll, we'll eventually get to the same place Whoa, really quickly look at th this. That is a palace. That is 
a beautiful stadium. That is definitely something that we're going to... Oh my gosh, mermaids. Mermaids! <sighs> Merfolk, I guess, technically. There will be merman, people. I guess, mer-thems. <laughs> mer <-theys. laughs> Oh, I'm so excited. So I see two additional shrines that we can unlock. We have not yet done one this whole time. So, I'm still waiting. Oh, here we go. We've activated... Oh, there's three shrines here. Okay, that's very cool. I don't anticipate... I cleared out that other side pretty well. So if, if there's something that blocks it, it will be one of... <laughs> Like three pieces of trash. Oh my god, watch it actually. No, phew. Okay. Ooh, going right into that oil spot. Ew. Oh yeah. Oh wow, there's even more stuff here. Okay, so one of these probably will travel through here as well. So it's actually quite good for me to still continue, continue down through this path. And it's our first sea salt. Now we need five, but hey, only four more to go. This is awesome. It looks like this is maybe another place we'd be able to provide offerings. I see there's like four circular stands over here, which is really cool. And see, oh. So we've got some potential puzzles we'll be able to figure out. I have no music notes. I don't know what I can play, but I will definitely be experimenting with that later. Oh my god. <laughs> There's so much that we've been able to discover today. We've only opened two more of the coral sites. We've only healed two more, counting that one that just went, which I'm pretty sure is blocked by something. Uh, yep, I see it. I see it. Oh, and I see another turtle who wants corn. It's corn. I wish I paid attention. Save my corn. <laughs> okay. But at least we know now, at least we know if we get higher corn, we can we'll be able to, to get through. And I know corn is going to crop back up soon because that's a crop we've planted. So... Oh my gosh, literally is heading through the one area that I did not. Oh, here we go. And it's 21, so we're we're getting pretty close here. And this is all again, you can see that that's not quite finalized. You just have sort of the 3D shapes there. There isn't the final textures or renders or anything like that. Um, it's not even fully like I don't know, maybe it's fully modeled, but um, what's really exciting is that we'll, we'll be able to see some of the details come in later as we dive into updates. Okay, so I don't have a corn, but I at least want to see if I can finish up just this area, see if I can at least get this final, final shrine. I'm pushing it, I'm getting pretty close to deadline in terms of passing out. It would be very tragic if I passed out underwater. No. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Really? Are you not going to give me that final, final relic? It's, it's, it's right there. It's right there. Okay, the game decided for me. It said, nope, not today. I, I've cleared out this area. There's only three. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh! <gasps> oh shoot! Oh, it forced me to leave. Oh, interesting. It's like you will not drown. 
<laughs> the little robot dragged me back to the surface. Well, shucks, I was so close. Okay. That's fine. I'm glad we didn't drown. <laughs> Thank you, robot. <laughs> Blood clam. Let's send one of the hermit crabs. I forget if we did the other. Let's check really fast. I don't think we saved any corn. <laughs> no, we did not. So we're going to have to make sure we save corn next time it crops up. I believe we should get another harvest in before the summer is over, so I'm not too concerned about that. We've done so much. I'm so proud of us. Um, lots of progress made today. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Find me at Kimchika everywhere. Twitch, TikTok, here. Uh, <laughs> co-host mastodon i don't know i'm like trying to figure out places because twitter is like eh, but um we'll see and um i hope you all have a wonderful day or night you're finding lots of indie games to play and i'll see you in the next episode bye